Hi guys, it's Ratchet Raw and today we're going to continue playing Criminal Case and we are going on Case 29. Alright, thank you friends, let's go. Hey, what's gonna happen now? Let's see the picture. Oh, my goodness, the White Peaks Project. What's it gonna be? Hey guys, how is it going? Is this your last case? A Capromaniac? That must have been a threat. Well, treat for you, Elite, because poor Amy is still shaken up by the fact that her crush snacks off people. I hope Amy and her family will help her recover, which means it's just you and me today, Katrina. Katrina, how to help me? Something must have happened to her. Amy, what the heck are you doing here? Who are you talking about? My friend, Virginia. She was supposed to meet me this morning, but I haven't heard a word all day. I'm so scared for her. She got murdered, we already noticed that out. Don't worry, kid, Katrina will find this Virginia for you. Where do you think she could be? She was filming a documentary about the origins of the Nighthawk for Legend up in the deep woods. Please, Katrina, let me come with you. I can help. Katrina tried to out of the question, Amy. And what happened with Bobby? The only thing you get to do is watch bad reality TV while eating ice cream. Understood? Alright, yes, you're right. I'll just go home then. But call me if you find anything. Okay. I already think of what I'm thinking, Katrina. If something bad happened to Virginia, well, she got murdered, I already noticed that out. Amy might not be able to suffer another shot. The whole bomb if you ask her. Do I should measure the deep foot. Virginia might have gotten lost there. Let's go. Okay, her name is Virginia. And Virginia is the name of the state in the America. Whatever. Okay, let's rescue deep boots. Okay, there she is. Yep, we were right. She got murdered. Right? Okay, I bet someone pushed her on that. Whatever it's called. Okay. Oh, that's her camera. All right. Okay, card. Okay, where's the nest? Oh, uh, where are you? There you are. Tree stop and broken branch. Oh, there you are. Oh, it's covered in blood. We're gonna have to collect a sample from that. Or we're just gonna send it right away to Jan. Okay. I can't believe it. There's no way this girl impaled herself by accident. Maybe his childhood friend has been murdered. You're right, we better keep this to ourselves for as long as possible. But I still need to get her body to the Good catch. Amy did mention Virginia was filming a documentary. The broken video camera I found must be hers, but you have to restore it. And then she said that the documentary was about the origins of the Night Walker legend. Damn, Katarina, could this be why she got killed? You're right, I'm getting ahead of myself. What about that blood impression? The blood must be Virginia's, yes, but if you think there's something else, don't be my guess. We found a business card too. Maybe the curator decided to sign it and cry for a while. So quick, let's curl what was written on it. Okay. So, you are also interested in the Nightwalker, alright. Okay, let's start the autopsy, and I'm gonna need some stars to do all of this, so see you a little bit. Okay, I really managed to collect three stars, so let's first do this broken camera. Alright, here we go. Okay, like that, alright. Okay, just eat energy. Good job, because that camera found next to Virginia's body container. Cool, that thing still uses VHS tapes. The downside is that the tape is stuck. Where is this mess to Hannah? Oh, I knew we were gonna send her. We we're gonna send her that camera. Only five minutes. Oh, that's nice, alright. Let's do this business card now. Roberto Vasquez, call me and smile. Oh, oh, how do you call this smile? Okay, you made that smile now. Frank, I don't know how it's called, but whatever. Good job recovering the words in that business card you found next to Virginia's body. It belongs to Roberto Vasquez. Roberto Vasquez, hey, is he the cookie guy who's obsessed with the Nightwalk? We met him before. 
I had no idea that Roberto was a filmmaker, but his home is soon on the car implies he knew the victim. I agree. Let's go talk to him. Oh yeah, I remember him. He, 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 Sorry, uh, his brother got murdered, you remember the, his name is, uh, Juan, I think, alright, and he was the ice skater, and yeah, that's very really romantic, okay, here we go, what do we got on this branch? No, I just mixed each other, okay, here's, great job with this, viewers of the branch fell at the crime scene, but I'm not convinced it's going to let, lead us anywhere. Of course, I really the boss. Let's send those students for analysis. Yeah. Who's the boss? I'm the boss. Okay, how long is it gonna take? Three hours. Okay, I need one more star to talk to Roberto. So see you a bit. Okay, I have one star. So, here we go. Let's go talk to Roberto. Hey, did you miss us? Okay, here's that, whatever it's called, that house, alright. Roberto, they said I asked you to talk to you about Virginia Watchbird's murder. We know you two knew each other. She's dead? What a shame. The girl was really cute and smart at that. We talked a couple of times. I left her my car, but she never called back. I guess she was too busy with her documentary to realize what a catch I am. Weren't you interested in her documentary, actually? We know how much you love the night walker. Well, I was too busy appreciating the filmmaker to care much about the footage, although I doubt it was any good anyway. To make a good documentary, I had to think for like your subject to become one with their history and their psych psychology, 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 something like that, okay. Virginia was much too nice for that. Okay. Okay, only one minute to finish this video camera. Alright, see you a little bit. Alright, video camera has finished, so here we go. What's what is it? Really got a VHS ask video camera is the eighties or something. If only they didn't manage to restore the tape. It's as good as new as leveled behind the scenes number four. I borrowed an old VHS player from the archive so you could take a look at the footage yourself, Katarina. Oof, okay, here we go. Oh god. I had to stay far, I had to stay focused on the documentary, no matter who threatens me. I had to find out the truth about the riches of the Nightwalk. But if something happens to me, everything about my research is in the abandoned distillery. It's very important that you remember it. It's in the abandoned distillery, what other it is. Where is it? Who is there? Show yourself. You. What do you want? Oh. What's gonna happen? Hey, don't touch my camera, leave it alone. End of the footage. Directly, someone put their fingers on Virginia's camera to take it away from her. It must have been her killer right before the murder. But she did say that her research was in an abandoned distillery. All that fermenting booze lying around. If only we, we knew its location. Oh, that's a good area. Here, that's the, there's an old distillery out of the outskirts of town, right next to the forest. See, Hannah, when you put your mind to it, you can actually be useful. And after that, we'll take a look at the old distillery. Okay. So, you were recording your documentary, you were talking about Nightwalker, then something took your back and broke your camera and killed you. Okay, let's investigate the distillery. Okay, here we go. We need this, because it's broken. Oh, another tape, alright. Uh, gold stack, where is that? There you are, a uh, cardboard box, bowl, pumpkin, and a bottle. Moonshine bottle. Oh snap, I remember this. Moonshine bottle, it was... It was on my wall in the case back in the video blue. I don't remember much. Okay, look at all that booze got here, it's like Christmas. Oh, you're right, we better, we better get back to the investigation. This entity table looks like Virginia's center of operations. This broken VHS day we found must hold more of her footage, but you have to go for it. Hey, leave that bottle alone, Katarina. I saw it first. Hey! Don't, no drinking at the, at the job. Alright. You think it's a clue? If you there might be fingerprints on the level, you can take it. Okay. There we go, we have one star. Okay, let's do this. Moonshine bottle. Okay. Okay, 
some sort of blue shape all day. I better set it to kind of balance. Why can't I do? Can I do that? I'm a pro here. Nine hours for this. All right. Okay, I need one more start to do is probably wait VHS tapes to see a little bit. Okay, click the stars, so here we go, let's do this broken tape. Sorry, sorry, the VHS tape because hopefully there's some VHS footage on it. Yes, this is how all the material we need to watch here. I think what I'm thinking, Katarina. Yes, let's watch it now. What to do without the popcorn, though? No, 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 we're not gonna do it. We are on the job. Okay, I just see this one. Is it working? Is this thing even recording? Oh, yes, yeah, great. Hello, for my name is Virginia Watchman. I don't want to miss anything, so I'm gonna record everything I see. Oh, this is so exciting. My very own documentary about the night walk, no less. I always adore this slash. Now I'm gonna reveal its origins. Most of you know that the Nikon was actually a soldier one wounded during the Civil War, but his story doesn't end there. I'm going to reveal every detail of this tragic tale. And I have to thank Lola Dickinson, my producer, for this opportunity. This documentary will be sensational, you see. Okay, I'll do it. So, it really was hard by this whole oh, dig so to feel your dog better about the Nightwalker. Okay, very good talk to Miss Lola. And why did you say I need one more star to talk to this woman? No, bugger. Alright, see you a little bit. Okay, I have a star, so let's talk to this woman. What do you want, Lisa? I'm very busy at the moment. With Virginia dead, now I have a documentary with no director. Oh, you're, you know about the murder, huh? What? You're still going to be the greater even after the murder? It's dreadful what happened to Virginia, but I put a lot of money into this project. I can't let it die, too. I'll dedicate it to her memory. No one was as passionate about the night talk lunch, or she was so enthusiastic about it. But she shouldn't have been filming out in the woods alone. There are a lot of deranged people roaming around at night. Now she said that I got an unfinished project on my hands. Believe me, this night is turning into a real night because I okay. am. Okay. But she knew about the murder. I didn't even ask you. She said about that she was murdered. Okay. We gotta wait for this body favors and fingerprints to finish. So see you all a bit. Alright, we are back. Finally. Criminal case to see what happened to this one. Okay, I tried to do it fast. I don't want to happen. Be. Whatever, alright. Hey there, Katria. I took a look at Virginia Watchbird's body, and there's no doubt about it. The tree is what killed her. Yeah, no doubt, it was already. Oh, she was pushed against the tree and was impaled on a branch. It's an unconventional murder and a long, slow death. Thanks, Rox. We will get the picture. But Katria's right. What's the important thing is to keep this body hidden. Amy, Amy wants to see it. This is her childhood friend. Oh, really? That's a fortunate state. What do you mean? That's oh god, gee, it's not possible. How could this be happening? Who have done this to you? Amy, get out. Go back to your desk. This is at least as good as orders. Katarina, you have to find your killer promise. We'll find them. Great job, Roxy. <laughs> yeah. Congratulations. You just became... Anyway, whatever. I don't know how to say it. Whatever. Okay. Don't blame me, it's her friend. Amy has a right to know. Anyway, as I was saying, the priest of Virginia's wife told me where the kill had touched her. When I took a close look to close, I found just some pumpkin soap. Oh, pumpkin soap. Never tried that before, but whatever. So our kill drinks pumpkin, pumpkin soap. I guess a cold hearted murderer needs is a warm their soul. Okay. But you know, killer always has a reason to kill. So. Okay, we're gonna find out. Okay, here we go. Let's get some bad fibers. What are they about? I took a look at the bloody fibers you collect from that branch container. and I can tell you they are wool fibers. Well, it was obvious. White, and it looks like a rope. I don't remember. Okay. And more precisely, they are wool fibers coming from a pom pom. See, for a pom pom, the fibers are not nice but sued at one end. Which means the killer must have fallen on that branch and left the fibers there. You're looking for a killer wearing a pom pom in their clothing. Uh, okay. A pom pom. Our big bad murderer wears a pom pom. They don't sound that threatening now, do they, Katrina? Hey! Don't 
monsters. Sorry, I shouldn't talk like that. Papa or not, but GS Killer is a monster. Yeah, he's a monster. <laughs> okay. Wait, who's wearing that? Papa, okay. Okay, those two, but who is the killer? Okay. Let's get some that fingerprints. So the fingerprints you found on that bottle of bush have belonged to a certain Charlie Watchbird, arrested the ones for drug trafficking. Watchbird? What does that name sound, sound familiar, Katina? Katina is right, it sounds familiar because his name, last name is your victim, Virginia Watchbird. Charlie Watchbird is her cousin. Her cousin? He may be able to tell us more about Virginia. Let's talk to him. Okay. Oh, and he's got that pop up on his clothing. Okay. Let's go talk to Charlie. Can't believe someone would kill Virginia, he said Katia. She was the sweetest girl ever. Very close to your cousin Charlie. Like two pieces in a pot. I've tried to reno renovate this distillery and Virginia wanted to be close to the woods for her documentary, so I let her work here. Okay. Before the new filming a documentary about Cecilia Legend would turn out to be so dangerous. I should have protected her. I'm really going to tell her parents, I'll never be able to face them in family tears again. Okay. Later at the station. Alright, let's recap. Katrina. His friend Regina got killed in the deep woods while making a documentary on the night walk. He met with Lola, the producer of her documentary, who seemed more concerned about the money Virginia's murder was making her lose. But there's a bird who really tried to flirt with Virginia. What is it all adding up to Katrina? What? You think we should retrace Virginia's steps through the forest? <coughs> oh, damn it, my voice again. Uh, okay. Now? But it's pitch black outside. Hey, we gotta go. I'm gonna go. I don't know how to say that. Dude, you see how I started? I don't know what to say. Uh, except for the really what they're saying, okay? Oh, alright, if you really think that my help is fine, she is here, but if we get lost, I'm blaming you. No, we won't get lost, Frank. Alright, here we are in the middle of the night. We are completely lost, Katarina. Can you see anything? A landmark? A liquor store? Anything? Oh, ho, 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 a paper. Well, what the hell is that? What? It's a picture. I think I know the face, Katarina. Oh my god, it's a Nightwalker. I can't believe it. You're right, it's the face of the Nightwalker. Oh, snap, snap. Okay, guys, we're gonna stop here. We're gonna continue playing in chapter 2. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like to this video, and I'll see you again. Goodbye.